Hello there, my name is Musoma from Dos Idea Systems. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how you can customize your system upon connection. Please subscribe to this channel and click the notification bell for new videos. So visit doshile.ug and you will be able to get to this page. Then click login using school ID and user ID as they are part of the details you received. Enter your school ID and the user ID. Then also enter that password and click login. Here you'll be able to access your school system. Then as you can see the name of your school will appear and your name as the person who connected the school together with other details, the various menus on results, features, uh, fees tracker and so on. So here, what you need to do is to go to this menu where you get update information. This is the area where you update uh, all the school information from before you start adding other members. So you click update information, then click manage school general information, enter your password, the one you used to log in and click OK. Under that section, you are able to update school information on class sections, uh, dormitories, in case your school has a boarding section, co-curricular houses, school subjects, and so on. So you start with, like, say, class sections, and you just click on class sections in order to give the details about, you add the classes and their streams. You go to, let me refresh a bit. So you have to refresh in case your network is interrupted. You just go to the same menu, click dashboard refresh. And when it is settled, you just go to update information and you resume. Click manage school general information. Enter your password. And now cl click on the class sections in order for you to start adding the classes. So you just click add classes and class streams. Each class is handled independently. So you choose a class, for example, Senior 2. Then you will have to add those streams as they apply in your school. Senior 2 East, West, maybe Senior 2 Green. It's a new stream. You just add it and you click Add Class. When you are done, you go back to Update Information. You update other details under Manage School General Information. Enter your password. And then you go to the next section, for example, for subjects. Because the subjects you add will be now listed for you to select for those other uh, members of the school. If you are adding teachers, the subjects you'll add will appear as you are adding so that you can attach it to a staff member or a learner who is undertaking that subject. So you just have to fill each field with a subject and ensure that all the subjects are listed. Some subjects are different in terms of the names, like we have ICT for the new curriculum, S1, S2. Then we have, uh, have sub-ICT, which applies to A-level. And then we have uh, computer studies, which is going to apply only to senior four come 2023. For other subjects, with, for other classes, they will have uh, ICT. So we have to be conscious with that. You can even work with the DOS in order to help you get done with this task and you click add subjects in order for you to update. When you are done with the subjects, you can go to other menus as well, update information, manage school general information, and you enter your password, click OK. Then you update those other details. You update the logo of your school, assessment categories, those which your school undertakes. So that is how the process of customizing your school system or setting up your school system is done once you log in after connection. Thank you for watching.